Hi everyone, just a quick video. I've got a Skoda at the minute and I'm trying to get rid of that annoying light in the corner. A seatbelt reminder. It's not something you should switch off. I'm switching it off purely because I do a lot of maneuvering with the trailer and it's just constantly going on. You should not really disable it. It's just annoying to get in and out of a car every five seconds and putting the seatbelt on. It's just to show you how to program it out if you need to. We go into select control module in VCDS. Then we go into instrument cluster. Then we go into coding. And this is the thing, you have to save the details that you've got on it because if you forget what it was, there's no default button. So if you wipe it off, it's never gonna come back. You will mess it up. You just wanna make sure you take a picture of it, you take a screenshot of it, or you write it down, whatever you've had. It says here, plus zero two seatbelt warning. The way it works, you've got the digits. This is the coding. As this one shows, the option you want, the two numbers, the two leading zeros are always there. The next two numbers, the question marks, are what you need to have coded in. We've got a value of 07, right? Uh, Seatbelt wording is plus 02. If I'm going to subtract uh, 2 from this value, from those two numbers, this will give me disabling the seatbelt warning. So basically what I do is we got 00, zero which is stays the same. Uh, we got 07. Because it's plus 02, it means if I change 07 to 05, that should disable the warning basically. So what I'm gonna do is change that to 5, then go do it. Have a look, you've got seatbelt warning light on when I click do it seatbelt light is off right this is how you program it out to change it back you have to change that number to 07 again it's not hard but it's a bit confusing if I start driving now it shouldn't come up with any sort of bings bongs any ding dongs or anything like that see there's no audible notification that you haven't got the seatbelt on. You have to have your seatbelts by law, so you can only program it just for the time being. As I said, I'm only doing this because I've got a lot of maneuvering around this yard. This is why I switched it off. Just wanted to show you so you know how to program. I couldn't find any clear information on how to properly code it. That's why I thought I'm gonna do the video. Close controller, go back, and it's done. Yeah. Once you've programmed it out, it doesn't even switch on. When you start the car back up, it doesn't come back with it. I've got a check engine. It's a Volkswagen Group, so you can expect that. Volkswagen, das Auto. But yeah, that's it. See you on the next one. See you shortly.